baby Was gonna disappear You know why? Waited so long Waited so long We waited so long This, this is peace in our time Oh darling and then I'll get by. I think. I oh, know. I'll get by maybe. Maybe 13. Yeah. Take a look. Just look. As you walk away. Don't know what to say. Alright, we're not using a lot. Just in case, um... Some of the music, you know, gets get you a block. You can still play it, but you can't, I mean, I can't, um, I can't download it the original way. And then there's no clicker there you can click on. But anyway, for anyone who stops by and anyone who's listening to the show, I mean, yesterday, you know, I, I said a few things, I mean, and then I, I said to myself, I don't know, maybe they probably won't understand. I mean, because I'm doing some some of the ways and some of the, the the structure, some of the things I'm implementing here are, are like my um my thing. I mean, because we're doing it like it's like a Jerry Seinfeld kind of a, a concept here. It's like making much ado about nothing. All right, let me get to that point. I, I when you hear me go on like like and just get like start stumbling on my words and everything you realize I'm, I'm sensitive I don't want to turn anybody away from the show and I don't want to and on the other hand I don't want to scare anyone either but I was just you know someone's you know happened to to like one of the videos go ahead we're doing a show here it's a live show we got Eddie money you can go I mean really there's nothing um, nothing planned I have a hat on today because uh, I have a little bit of a, of a head cold. It's like, well, I just took some of that Deslum. Maybe close enough. I don't know. Delsum. It's pretty good. But it was like, my nose itches. And then you like you sneeze and stuff like that. But uh, it, it works its way out. You know, I had it for a couple of days. But, you know, you just you get by. Money says, but I get excited when I have like uh, anyone from the childhood, you know, that, that stop by, you know, that, that you know stops by, and um, I just said something about. I have some because when I'm doing the show, I often have memories of uh, of playing jail, playing uh, you know hide and seek and all that, you know, kick the can, games like that. Yeah. Go to the radio. Just seeing if there's anything good on there. Yeah, this brings back memories too. We did a we did a video one time. We got a like from a childhood friend. I was like Brianna. I think it was Brianna. James by the night or something. It would had me turn the radio on. It was a Fleetwood Mac song. Having said all that, let's get down to business. But yes, I um, I do get a little sentimental, and I do use some kind of things from from that kind of perspective, uh, along with others. You know, that's I'm I'm not just a one trick pony. You know, I just go with it. I use a, a lot of different methods. So we have Dave Chappelle, and um, and he's saying some stuff. And the ironic part is he's trying to get someone elected. And another weird thing about it was when he was talking about him, you know, the guy he's trying to get elected. Many of you probably know. I don't know. It's in Minnesota. I don't know where or wherever Dave grew up. I think that's where um, that's where it is. You know, he's I see him a lot. He was on the Al, uh, alley. Is that how you say his name? Alley. Alley, I don't know, the alley, the beat with Alley. And yesterday we shared a little bit of Method Man, you know, the thing there, I don't know. Sometimes things don't work, sometimes they they do, sometimes they don't. You know, we just, um, 
we just go on uh, not our own understanding, but uh, understanding of uh, like universe or like the way it is, the way it's going. I mean, like during the week. See, I want to tell I want to tell a, a, a lot of friends that are, that are liberals and Democrats or people that believe in uh, in, in that that sort of um, way of uh, you know governing. We also have to have democracy. You know, we can't just like eliminate people. I mean, especially like the signs and all that kind of stuff. Okay, so if Dave Chappelle goes on, all right, anyone, a lot of people will go on and on and on about Obama and everything. Then you would think, like I like I often said here on the show, I said you think it'd be like a shoe in You think there'd be no hesitation. You you you, you would say to yourself, well, why would Republicans like be getting elected in House and you know, in Congress and you know all you know, Senate? But again, we take it lightly. And the foundation of the show is like all politics are local, and uh, I kind of I, I kind of agree on that. I agree on that. When you look at how it's being spread around, how it's being like you know, accurately not not accurately, um, yes, you kind of out of your allocate allocate. Okay, thank you. How it's being allocated, you know. How, um, you know, certain areas and it's certain people, it's like the haves and have nots, it's just, it's way out of whack. Way out of whack. And, um, so, so Chappelle's talking about, you know, how Trump, Trump sees it in a, in a small lens. Like, he's focusing on a small lens of, of people. I mean, if you thought, like, you know, with, with Keanu West, that was obscure. And by the way, Keanu West is bringing up some some important things. Because if he's a joke, if he's incoherent, if he's this, if he's that, you know, if he should stick to music because he's a genius there, what, what, what would be the hype? This story is still going. And I think, um, I think it will go for a little bit longer. I mean, it's like that. It's like the night of CNN has, you know, Dave Chappelle... Then they bring out uh, Camille Bell, you know, the United Shades of America, and he has, like, the, he's visiting, uh, the KKK, and there's some, some false myths about the KKK themselves. I mean, the guy, the Grand Poopa wizard, I don't know, Imperial Wizard was saying, um, something in, in the Bible talking about, you know, a racial, interracial, uh, marriages are prohibited. That's false. It's totally incorrect. I'm willing, uh, I'm willing to, to stay, say that, because I just know. I just studied with some people that, you know, it is a, it is a mixture. It's like 50-50. This, and the reason why I liked him, the reason why I studied with him, and if you ever, like, like see him, you know, give, give him a chance. And at least talk to him, just to see, because they're all pretty much on the same page. But uh, there's nothing in there. I went over that uh, numerous of times with uh, you know the guy I was studying with. But it was a relaxful thing, you know. It, it kind of it was more happening than than like what was going on, you know. Especially you know after you know 2008, 2009, you know circumstances. I was. Uh, at this place and everything, and uh, gave me strength, you know, it gave me endurance, you know, it, it, it made me interested in it, like, you know, I mean, to just, like, to just say to yourself, well, it must be happening for a reason, I know, a lot of people, they, they kind of discredit that, but, but there are things, you know, that, that do inspire you, it's like, okay, I can cry about it, I can protest, I can turn things around, I can like, like Brooke Baldwin, like she's having a conversation, she's having a conversation, this, this is bizarre, and the girl, you know, she has a right to state her opinion, she's talking about all the things, I mean, just like, you know, people on the left have a right to state their opinion, you know, it's especially about like how Trump is, like, I don't like it the way he talks, I don't like the tone, I don't like this, it's just, it's just different. 
He's just saying it like it is. What's on his mind? So you're like, enough's enough. Like, what's holding things up all the time? So the girl was like talking about stuff like, you know, you shouldn't be crowd people at restaurants. You shouldn't be doing this. You shouldn't be taking away speech, you know. And, you know, she's talking to Brooke Baldwin and she's like, you know, it's like, kind of like a mob thing. And Brooke's like, don't, don't say the M word. I'm like, what? You know, I mean, now, I mean, this is where it's become. I think they're they're so wrapped into like using a certain you know like certain things. I mean, like what Keanu West said. Somebody is what, what was saying like you know this scares him. This scares him because because there is something there is something to it. I mean, it's like like handicap like or or something or it's like special needs and stuff like that in a way some of the things he was he was talking about and other people were talking about i know probably not making sense it's probably the the cough medicine 